Welcome back. I'm in the Walker Emissions Control Test Lab with Joe Baccarella, who's going to review step number three in the diagnosis of a vehicle emissions control problem. And step three is to conduct a thorough leak inspection of the exhaust system, right Joe? That's right, Deneen. Having a leak-free system is absolutely vital because the engine management system relies on accurate data about the composition of the exhaust gases to help optimize fuel trim and other variables. Even a small leak anywhere in the system can draw a significant amount of oxygen into the exhaust stream. Because the converter can only store a finite amount of oxygen within its catalyst substrate, the rear O2 sensor will detect this excessive oxygen and generate a converter efficiency code. Where do most leaks occur, Joe? There are a few common areas. In the welds around the O2 sensor fittings, around gaskets, and at any point where there is a swivel or flex joint. In some vehicles, we're also seeing leaks in and around the exhaust manifold. There are a couple of great ways to find a leak. One of the best and easiest is with a smoke machine. If you don't have one of these, grab your shop vac and some soapy water. Stick a rag in the tailpipe and then turn on the shop vac in the blow mode and direct the flow into the intake manifold with the throttle open. This will pressurize the exhaust system. Now spray soapy water on all the fittings, gaskets, and joints and look for bubbles. Do not blow into the system from the tailpipe because you can push a lot of built up rust and other contaminants into the engine. Great tips, Joe. Thanks for your help. And thanks for tuning in. Be sure to join us for step four in our next program.